I really like my life. I have the capability to live wherever I want, at this stage in my life at least, and I do what I want to do on a daily basis, for the most part at least. But living this life was not a quick, fast thing, because I'm frankly not special. I'm not the smartest person there is, not the tallest person or the most beautiful person there is. See, I consciously built this life from the ground up. I didn't woke up one morning and realized, whoa, my life was sh yesterday, but today I lived the life I want to live. No, rather it's a combination of decisions and habits that I've made over the last five years at least. Today I'm going to show you which things you have to do on a daily basis to get closer to that spectrum of freedom and therefore make you love your life. So this is not a quick and easy process and I have absolutely nothing to sell to you at the end. This video should actually be here to help you. I'm going to show you 5 meta skills, meaning skills that when applied will improve every other skills and aspects of your life. These skills improve the 4 pillars of your life, health, wealth, love and the summation of those 3 happiness. Are you ready? Let's hit it! Number 1. The art of nutrition. Our digestive system is a very impressive tunnel structure that goes to our organism. It's the biggest contact that we have with our environment. So contrary to popular belief, the skin is actually only the second largest organ in the human body. The inside of the small intestine alone is 15 to 20 times larger. I'd argue then that what we eat is very freaking important. Now how can you use nutrition to improve your life? Eat freaking healthy. Eat your f***ing vegetables. Completely changing your eating behavior in one day is extremely hard though, but have at least one meal every day that you're proud of. The easiest thing to do that is to eat a healthy breakfast. Wake up 15 minutes earlier if it needs to be and have a healthy breakfast. A good idea is to have some oats combined with soy milk, two bananas and some flax seeds sprinkled on top. Number two, the truth about being nice. We live in a more and more disconnected world. Most of us meet our partners or our friends online or some of us don't even have any friends. This is okay if this is your choice, but if you'd like to meet new people, one of the easiest thing is to give out compliments. So simply be nice. Are you on the phone with a person from a company and the person did a very good job? Tell them. Just say, I think you've made a very good job today and you're a very competent person. Thank you. Whenever you buy something in a supermarket, try to give the female or male cashier a compliment. Hey, I've seen the tattoo there that you have. It looks really nice. It will feel weird first, but guess what? It makes yourself feel good and the person at the other side. I've never met a person that got offended by a compliment that I gave them. This point improves your happiness and if you're lucky, you love life. So give at least one compliment to a friend or a stranger a day. Number three, moving your body. The fundament of our brain is movement. We human beings are meant to be moving around, scavenging for food and looking for places to inhabit. In recent years, our life has become civilized. This is great for safety reasons, but really bad for our entire body. If we don't exercise, our digestive system doesn't function as well as movement helps us digest by moving food through our intestines. Exercise also improves our heart and the cardiovascular system, which pumps blood to our body. My recommendation is to at least go for a short walk every single day. It can take only 20 minutes. If you can't go for a short walk, aim to go to the gym three times a week and get some higher intensity exercise in. This will not only make you healthier, it will also make you a happier, more well-rounded person. Number four, learn something new. One of the biggest advantages of the human species is that we can learn from other people's mistakes. And the way we learn from other people's mistakes is to talk to them, watch them or read about them. I found that reading is the best way for me that I can learn something new. For you, it might be listening to audiobooks or watching cool YouTube videos. Smash the like button. In any of those cases, make sure that you spend at least 30 minutes a day learning something new. While this doesn't make a huge difference in a month or so, it makes a huge difference in a year or 10 years. I do not recommend you reading romance, comic books or sci-fi books. They do not count. What I'd recommend you is to read non-fiction books related to the problems that you currently have. Why? Because your problems are not special, they're not unique. Learn from other people's mistakes and learn from other people that solve the problems that you have right now. This improves all aspects of your life. Number five, and this is arguably the most important point, if you're afraid to do something, go out and do it. This is very unconventional, but do something that you're scared of doesn't have to be every day, but at least once a week. This practice should catapult you out of your comfort zone in no time. 
A lot of the stuff that I do, I'm afraid of doing. I was afraid of starting a business, making YouTube videos, traveling to a new country and living in Indonesia right now. Yet yeah, true greatness is acting despite of your emotions. Over time, you realize that what fear truly means is false expectations appearing real. Now disclaimer, don't do something that can actually kill you. And if you do, don't blame it on QG. Conclusion, five things to do every day that will make you love your life. These are the five things, the five meta skills, so to speak, the practices that you need to do every single day. Number one, follow a healthy diet. If you can't eat 100% healthy, eat at least a healthy breakfast. Number two, give people compliments. This literally costs you nothing but will dramatically increase your life quality. Number three, move your body regularly. This increases your health and makes you look awesome. Number four, learn something for at least 30 minutes a day. Read non-fiction, listen to audiobooks, or watch YouTube channels, which are quite cool. Yeah, smash the like button. Number five, do something you're scared of. This puts you out of your comfort zone and is similar to leveling up in a video game. Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time. The mission of this YouTube channel is to put veganism across the goal line. If you want to help us achieve that, like and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Let's make food production great again.